Today in our 2012 Chevrolet Traverse, we're going to be installing the Tow Ready T1 connector, part number 118450. To begin our installation, we'll first open up the rear access door, and we need to remove the driver's side taillight assembly. To do that, we'll take a small flat bladed screwdriver here and remove the fastener covers. Now we can go ahead and remove the two fasteners securing the taillight housing. As you remove the housing, be careful not to break the alignment tab. Now with the taillight assembly removed, we can see the alignment tab here. We need to be careful not to break off as we remove the assembly. As you can see, the taillight wiring runs into the taillight assembly here. To disconnect the manufacturer's wiring, we'll simply press on the connector lock and separate the two connectors. Now we can go ahead and set the taillight assembly aside. With the driver's side removed, we can now go ahead and take the new T1 harness with the yellow and brown connector and plug in line with the manufacturer's wiring on the driver's side. Next, we'll go ahead and take the green wire connector and feed it down between the body fascia and the sheet metal of the body so that we can access it underneath the vehicle. We'll repeat the same process with our four pole connector. Next, we'll take the white wire with the preformed ring terminal and our self-tapping screw and make our ground connection here behind the driver's side taillight assembly. With that done, we can now go ahead and make connection with the taillight assembly and reinstall it. Next, I'll move over to the passenger side and remove the taillight assembly just as we did on the driver's side. With that done, I'll now go ahead and get underneath the vehicle and start routing our wires. For this application, we'll go ahead and remove the two push pin fasteners, securing some of the underbody trim panels so that we can tuck our wire up underneath, safely securing it. Now with our fasteners removed, let's go ahead and start routing our wires. As you route your wires, you need to be mindful of excessive heat such as exhaust or moving components such as steering or suspension. The four pole connector will come out from underneath the bumper fascia here towards the center so it can be routed over to the hitch. While our green wire will get tucked up underneath the underbody trim panels or fascia and be routed all the way over to the passenger side. Once over here, I'm going to go ahead and add a pull wire or wire leader using a piece of air tubing or wire to route it up behind the passenger side taillight assembly just as we fed it down on the driver's side behind that assembly. Now with our wire in place, we can go ahead and go back and secure the four pole to the hitch as it routes to the center of the vehicle and reinstall our fastener securing our green wire. With that completed, I'll now move back to the passenger side taillight assembly, make connection with the manufacturer's wire and our taillight assembly and reinstall it. Now with both taillight assemblies reinstalled, this will complete the installation of our Tow Ready T1 connector, part number 118450 on our 2012 Chevrolet Traverse.